Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fire Center. I hope everyone's well. All right, we're still throwing them out for September. We've got four more to do, so let's just get right after it. Aquarius, you're up. Okay. This reading will be for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay too. You can check your Moon, Rising, or Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid and all things can and be, but vice versa. Might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. And I do have friends, the cross watchers are always welcome here at the Firestone Tarot table. Everybody's always welcome at my table. I appreciate you guys stopping by. I mean, I'm not sitting at a table, but you get the drift, right? Okay. <laughs> so, before we get too far into it, Aquarius, a couple of quick things we got to go over. One, never make a life altering decision based on a tarot reading. I just don't recommend it. And by life altering, I mean if it's going to destroy everything you worked for. If you make the wrong decision, I would not trust a deck of cards if I were you. Mine or anybody else's. It is your free will to do whatever you choose to do. And you hold all the liability at the end of the day. Two, if it is not your reading, not your story, not your message, leave the cards on the table and walk away. And this is a general reading. It's not going to resonate with every Aquarius, so it might not be your message. That's okay. We'll try again next time. All right. Let's see if I can shuffle without shaking the Chromebook too much. Really trying hard not to. I may have to get out of the lotus position and put one foot on the floor. Oh, the Knight of Pentacles has revealed itself to me. Could be dealing with some slow moving energy, possibly could be dealing with an earth sign person. We'll see if it comes back out. Yeah, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to, uh, there we go. Get one foot on the floor so we're a little bit more stable. All right. Heavenly Father, Mother of the Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides and Archangels, I ask for any message you have for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for September 2021. I thank you for coming down and hanging out with me today. I appreciate you. I'm grateful and thankful for this gift that I've been given, and I ask that you help me use it to clearly and accurately bring Aquarius to their highest possible spiritual good and put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Aquarius, why are you here? The moon has decided to come out. Hmm, could be dealing with the Pisces. It's a card of secrets, things not quite being illuminated. Hmm. You're in the dark about something. Okay, well, what happened? Wheel of Fortune reversed for the past. If something was left unfinished. Could be dealing with a karmic. Hmm. King of Cups in the present. I'm not going to say emotional closing off. I'm going to say you're not being outward with your emotions right now. The feelings are there, but you're not expressing them. Ace of Swords for the future. Hmm. Possibility of a new start. New communication, new thoughts. Could be the next leg of the journey, but I don't know. It, it's, it's truth, it's honesty, it's communication. We'll get a clarifier in a second. Ten of Cups is the outcome, so can't be all bad. Let's just let's just see what the rest of the cards have to say. All right. First card out was the Moon card of Pisces. Pisces is a water sign. We will get the energy of the person that you are dealing with or a situation with the Gilded Tarot. Okay. Universe Source Spirit Guides. Can I get the clarity? Oh, sorry. Can I get the energy of the person or situation that Aquarius is dealing with? 
September 2021 person or situation that Aquarius is dealing with. One more shuffle. Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords for the past. Could have been quick communication. Maybe they've been watching you for a while. Hmm. Air sign. Possibly. Two of Wands reversed. They are currently... Oh, that fantastic intersection of where do I go and what do I do? They're stuck at the intersection. Maybe the light's out. I don't know. They're stuck there, though. Not sure what came first, the chicken or the egg. Maybe they're stuck because you're emotionally closed off or you're emotionally closed off because they're stuck. I don't know. Hmm. Strength card for the immediate future. That brings Leo to the board. It's holding back. Holding back. Holding back what, I wonder. Outcome. Fool. New journeys, new paths. Okay. Well. Huh. We need clarity, friends. Clarity. Universe source spirit guides can get clarity and the cards on the daybed for <laughs> Aquarius September 2021, please. Pardon the background. Things are just kind of all over the place because we're shuffling things around while I'm on vacation for the next three days. So it's going to be interesting to say the least but again I wanted to get these up by the end of the day so all right move you out of the way <laughs> what's the deal with the wheel of fortune reverse why is the wheel of fortune reversed here Oh gosh, that's going to shake that horribly. I'm going to have to not rough shuffle this. <sighs> Sorry, Aquarius, we've been making you a little seasick. Seven of cups upright, five of wands reversed. Hmm. Confusion, avoidance of conflict. Temptations, possibly. It is the Seven of Cups in the upright. Options. Hmm. Why the Seven of Cups? I'm feeling like this return might have you a little bit mystified. Okay, these two decided to come out. King of Wands reversed, Queen of Swords reversed. This is something that in the past you had no intention of moving forward with, you had no passion for, you could probably had a bad attitude about it, possibly just try to avoid con conflict with it, and it made it come back around. Hold on one second. Madness decided to get up for the day because she has to work this afternoon. So, okay. Um, where were we? Possibly had a bad attitude toward it, had no passion for it, no intention of moving forward, and maybe you had other options. Just wanted to avoid conflict with this person, but it came back around. Or you failed to close the cycle up because you didn't want conflict with this person. Could be that, too. All right. 
by the King of Cups. Queen of Cups reversed. Emotional closing off. The emotion is there. You are not expressing it. You are keeping this deep inside. One more. Could be negative emotions too. You do you do want to come out of the cold with this person though. Five of Pentacles reversed. So if you have negative emotions toward it, why do you want to come out of the cold with it? Nine of Cups, you're good on your own. So you're good on your own, but the air's chilly. You miss them. Aquarius, why do you confuse me? All right, what's up with this nine of Knight of Swords? For the past, for the other person, Devil Reverse, Shadow Side Reverse. Watched from afar. Psychotic obsession. Ten of Swords reverse. They never closed this out either. Sudden communication. Came in fast. It never closed out. It was painful and it never closed out. I'm not taking seven cards, so we're going to put those back. Okay, hi. Ace of Swords, Four of Cups reversed. Again, pardon the cluster cluster cuss back there. We're moving things around. It's going to be a long day. Four cups reversed, ace of swords. I wanted a new start. New communication. But they felt like they were going to be ignored, or you ignored them. They were being ignored. They felt ignored. That's why they watched from afar. They felt you disconnecting. Painful second ever ended. Something was left hanging out there. Okay, I'm not beating a dead horse anymore. Why is the two of wands reversed here? The present for the other person. Why the two of wands reversed? Ace of wands. Gosh, they want to start that new cycle. They want to strike a match with you. Probably still got a little bit of a thing for you. Ten of Pentacles reversed, but they are afraid it's not going to be abundant and it's not going to work out. It's not going to be the dream that they want. Why not? One more. High Priestess Secrets. They in it's like they intuitively know that something was not on the up and up. Watching from afar, knowing that you're okay. There's a connection here, though. Erevent. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. They feel guided to you. They feel the connection, but they're afraid. They're afraid that it's not going to be abundant, or they don't have what it takes. Because you're good on your own. There's secrets. Things not illuminated. All right, moving into the immediate future. Why is the Ace of Swords here for Sagittarius? Or Sagittarius, Aquarius. Wow. You could be dealing with Sagittarius if that just flew out of my mouth. Don't know why that flew out of my mouth. Why is the Ace of Swords here for Aquarius? Nine of Wands reverse. Just happens to be a Sagittarius card. Just throwing that out there. Ace of Swords. Ace of Swords. 
One of the meanings of the Nine of Wands in the reverse is surrender. One more. Magician reversed. Strength reversed. Unable to hold back. Unable to manifest. Throwing in the towel. Throwing in the towel and the ace of swords. They're not able to manifest it. Why the magician reversed? Empress reversed, unable to manifest, not gonna grow. Not gonna grow. Why strength reversed? Nice swords reversed. I'm hearing if I can't say something nice, I'm not going to say anything at all. You may be getting blocked in the future. Or you may be blocking someone. I'm feeling like you're going to block someone. Like said, every social media profile to private or restricted <laughs> why is strength here for the other person why strength why strength for the immediate future two of wands upright six of wands upright ten of wands upright they're gonna letting this go they're letting this go they're harnessing the inner strength to let this go They're releasing the burden and declaring victory. By the Six of Wands. The Sun, Death. They're going to allow this death cycle to occur. I think, I think they're just given. They're given up and given God. Might let you know that they're giving up. They're releasing this. May still try to get your attention, but I think they're just giving up and getting God and trying to find their happiness elsewhere, working through this death cycle. Outcome, Ten of Cups. Why is the Ten of Cups here for Aquarius? Why the Ten of Cups? Queen of Wands. Knight of Cups. Two of Pentacles. Hanged Man. Accepting the fate of the situation. Knowing your worth. It could be new love coming in the future. Definitely see it, but acceptance of the situation and allowing change to occur. Finding your balance. Finally going from the ninth cup, ninth cup to the tenth cup, possibly. I mean... Nine plus one is ten. Maybe you, f maybe you find your tenth cup is the outcome, but I don't see it as this person. Because they have the fool. Why is the fool here? Temperance. Nine of Swords reverse. They're they're letting this. They are so letting this go. They are so regaining their balance. I feel like they're gonna go off on a journey and finally find inner peace. Five of Swords. Doing what's best for them. Probably all parties concerned at the end of the day. Nine of Pentacles. That's the single and free and freaking loving it card. King of Pentacles reversed. And the High Priestess. All right. 
Follow your intuition. Know your worth. And accept nothing less. Don't be this guy. Okay. And until you're ready, you are probably best to remain independent. Process any emotions that are going to go along with this. Separate from any toxic energies. And you will find your happy place with the sun. Okay. Aquarius, this has been your reading. Thank you for coming by. I appreciate you. Have a wonderful September. Know that you are loved. Be blessed. And I will catch you next time.